So this week's video is actually like a get ready with me get ready with me styled video for Thanksgiving since that's coming up this week and I just did hair makeup and a outfit suggestion um, for you guys so I hope you guys actually like enjoyed this video I'm actually working on another video coming up for next week and that'll be getting into like winter and holiday themed videos so if you guys enjoy this video make sure you guys give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you guys have any suggestions of videos that you'd like to see for this coming holiday season and I hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving so to start off my makeup I'm gonna be using my buxom foundation and I'm gonna be applying that with a damp beauty blender forgot to show you guys like what tube of concealer that I'm actually using but it's by Maybelline just so that you guys are aware and I'm just using it to touch up my under eyes and any little like spots spots and redness on my face and again I'm just taking my beauty blender to blend in everywhere that I put concealer on my face now I'm taking my L'Oreal True Match powder to just set my foundation and concealer on my face that way it doesn't come off during the day. So now I'm actually taking my Bare Minerals palette that has three different, um, well it's two different types of contour powders in it and then it has one highlight powder in it so I'm just taking the lighter um, bronzer in it just to contour my face and I'm putting it in below my cheekbones and I'm going to put it up above my eyebrows and on my uh, chin. So now from that same palette I'm taking the highlight and I'm using like a concealer brush for it just because it lays like it helps it lay down like better on my face and I'm just putting that right between my eyebrows, on my nose, on my cheekbones and I'm going to put it on my chin as well. So now I'm taking my Bare Minerals Frame and Define Eyebrow Pencil and it's, I'm not sure the exact name of the color but it's for blonde hair and it actually has like a spoolie brush on the end to brush up my eyebrows on it but I'm just going to be filling in my eyebrows with that pencil. I'm just taking my Urban Decay Eye Primer Potion to prime my eyelids for the base for my eyeshadow. Now I'm taking my Urban Decay Naked 3 palette and all the eyeshadows that I'm using from this uh, for this eye look are all from this palette. This color that I'm using is called Liar and that is what I'm using to put my lid in it. Precise um, eyeliner marker in black, and I'm just using it to create a thin line above my lash line. So, sorry again, I forgot to show you guys exactly what type of mascara I'm using, but I showed this in my last or two videos ago, and it is the Spider Mascara by Maybelline, is what I believe it's called. But I'm just using that to coat my um, upper and lower lash line, and then I'm using this NYX uh, lipstick that. I'm just lining my lips with it and then I'm just filling it in then. So this is what the makeup look looks like and now we're going to be going on to hair. So to start off with the hair, we're just going to be brushing out our hair making sure there are no tangles in it whatsoever. You want it to be easy to work with as possible. Next you're just going to be sectioning off your hair. If you have really thick hair you might need to do more sections but I'm just doing it into um, two sections and I have pretty thick hair. 
So I'm just going to be taking this tapered, uh, I believe it's about an inch barrel, and just going to be curling the sections of hair away from my face, and it doesn't really matter if you alternate or not on this bottom layer since they're going to be underneath the top layer of hair. And I'm just going to be doing this all around my head. So now on this top layer, you're going to be doing the same exact um, techniques as you did on the bottom layer. And I'm just Go taking the curls and, and no pulling them fear. away from my face. And then I do mix in a few Come going opposite directions on the side and towards the back. That way they just kind of mix together and looks more like natural. But I'm doing this on just all around my head again. Now I'm taking my Tresemme Weather Control Hairspray just to hold in place the curls. And since it was really windy out that day, I just did not want them to fall really fast. And then what I'm actually going to do next is stand up and just shake out the curls and loosen them up and mess them up just a little bit because they are going to fall more throughout the day, but I don't want tight ringlets in my hair. And this is basically just what the hair then looks like at the end. the underdogs, all hail the new kids, all hail the outlaws, Spielbergs and Kubricks, it's our time to make a move. It's our time to make amends. It's our time to break So the my top is actually from American Eagle, and I will link all of this stuff down below, but it is a size small, and my leggings are from Aeropostale, and they have this cute leather strip going down the sides, and then my boots are black and studded and leather, and they're from Steve Madden. Living like we renegades, hey, hey, living like we renegades, renegades. Renegades